Hey guys, what's going on? It's Tanil, and welcome to my channel. Be sure to hit that subscribe button and that notification bell. That way you're notified every time I upload a new video. And for those of you who have been here before, welcome back. You guys, I am back today with another reaction video. This video was sent to me. This is a show that I've never heard of. It's the Graham Norton Show. Um, but the guest that is on it is Seth MacFarlane. And I am a huge fan of Seth MacFarlane. So I was like, okay, yeah, out of all the uh, video requests that I've gotten over the weekend, this is one I definitely have to react to. This is Seth MacFarlane performing all of his uh, Family Guy uh, characters. <laughs> so I'm so excited. I'm a huge Family Guy and American Dad fan. I just absolutely adore Seth MacFarlane. He's so talented and so so cute <laughs> anyway i have that video but before we jump into today's video you guys i have to say thank you so much for all the love and support that you continue to show me across all of my platforms now if you have not joined me on OnlyFans, instagram tiktok or patreon all that information is in the description box below all right i have today's video so let's go ahead and jump into it because when you were directing yourself I said how hard was it as an actor not to do voices because that is kind of your life um, yeah, I mean, it, it was, it was, uh, it was, it was less of a, so a leap than I was, than I feared it would he's be. He's just talking. Um, he sounds like you know, I, during Brian. doing Family Guy, I had gotten into the, into the habit of being able to record a line and then go into the booth and listen to it and, and God, switch so off cute. my brain and kind of feel like I was listening, I'm listening to somebody else. Yeah. And that did kick in pretty this? Oh, this is old. early on into the process where I was able to run into Video Village and, and look at the, again, no clue what know, show look at the footage and see if I was doing Doing, doing it right. Yeah. How many voices do you do? Good. Sorry, oh, I don't mean to take yeah. over so your family interview. Family I'm just kind of curious. Like, like, how many can you do? Uh, how many? Is, uh, the... You know, just enough to avoid being myself. <laughs> 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 so it's a <laughs> family guy. <laughs> if family guy. If I guy, the characters you do, you do Peter, uh, Brian, Stewie, Quagmire, and then a. Wait, he does others. Quagmire? How did okay. I not know that? And are they all based on people? Or you I just... did not know he did Quagmire. They're, they're, they come from various places. Peter, I, I knew a thousand Peter Griffins growing up in, in New England. These guys who would not think before they spoke, like, Ever, no self-editing mechanism. Ever, <laughs> it's coming out here with no paper. And, uh, and then, uh, and Stewie is, is based on uh, uh, your own uh, Rex Harrison, who I was a big fan of. Wow. Yeah. Uh, mm. <laughs> mm. <laughs> And, and who Quagmire? Where's Quagmire from? That can't be a person. <laughs> Quagmire. <laughs> <laughs> if it is, he's not happy. <laughs> no, no, he's a bad egg. He, he, Quagmire. When I was a kid, I mean, um, like, my father he used so to funny. buy me uh, old radio dramas from the 40s and 50s. Um, and so I, so I would listen to these things, and the commercials were intact. You hear these old commercials, you know, Autolite brand spark plugs, the only spark plugs for you. And <laughs> like everyone had this high-pitched voice, which I guess the mics were more sensitive <laughs> to the mid-range voice at that time. And, and they all sounded like Quagmire, and so that kind of stuck with me. And when I was coming up with a voice for him, that he's, he's, he began as, a, as, a, as a, an impression of 1950s. Mm. Admit. Interesting. And when you're doing, because, you know, those characters are in scenes together. Yeah. Do you do one line after the other, or do you all do all one and then go back <clears throat> and do the other one? When I do a table read, yeah, I have to jump back and forth. It's like, hey, how, what's going on? Oh, hello, fat man. Oh, Stewie, how are you? <laughs> <laughs> back and forth. <laughs> it's good, right? Yeah. That is good. That is so incredible. <laughs> so <Showing us. laughs> <laughs> But then sometimes you do them separately. Yeah, when I when I record the shows, I I, I kind of literally do it one line at a time just to just to make sure that but I. But that's not really because of the voices. It's just because you have to be naked, completely naked for Brian. <laughs> 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 the essence of yourself. Com yeah. Completely emotionally and physically nude. Oh, can you do the cool whip thing? The what? The cool whip. <laughs> <laughs> No, I feel like like dance monkey. I feel like no. I just got a big stick. Like a barking do the, seal. Do the like thing. A barking seal, aren't I, Graham Norton? <laughs> <laughs> you know, you're an Irishman. You think these people accept you as one of, one of their own people? <laughs> <laughs> they don't accept you at all. Um, yeah, so Brian, would you like some cool whip? But why, why, why are you saying it like that? What am I saying? I'm saying cool whip. I love that. <laughs> Oh, you're saying cool whip. Yes, I'm saying cool whip. <laughs> you're putting a lot of emphasis on the H. No, cool whip. I say cool whip. <laughs> say cool. Cool. Whip. Say whip. whip. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. 
<laughs> it's all recycled vaudeville humor. That's all. <laughs> That's good. But of course, now, as good as that is, not the only person on the couch who does who does voices, mm -hmm. because we've heard uh, Charlize's Bach, oh, the, the South African <laughs> goat. Which was very good. But it was excellent. Oh, thank you. Thank you. It was excellent. Yeah. Thank you. I'm yeah. sampling it. It's going to be my ringtone <laughs> from <laughs> now on. <laughs> but no, Emily Blunt. She's like, I heard you earlier. You do do a TC, don't you? <laughs> you do do a TC. <laughs> Not after Seth, I mean, right? Oh, yeah. 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 Goat noise. <laughs> 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 oh, go on, do one, do one line of Tom. Oh, what line should I do? I don't know. I, don't know. I feel the need, the need for speed. <laughs> That's good. You're good at it. <laughs> do me. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no. Okay. Do me again. Do me again. Do me again. Do me again. <laughs> Do, <laughs> 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 I do Donald Duck. Do Donald Duck. You do Donald Duck? Yeah. Do you? Do it. Well, okay, now it's your turn. That's, that's going to be my text message alert. <laughs> yeah. Very good. <laughs> and and my, my last bit of uh, getting a stick and poking Seth is... I don't know what that means. <laughs> is, is, uh, so Liam Neeson, Liam Neeson's yes. in A Million Ways to Die the West. So did you ever do your Taken, your version of the Taken phone call for him? Uh, <laughs> oh, you got to hear this. The, the, Come the, on, the, man. The... <laughs> do it. Our version on Family Guy was Kermit the Frog doing <laughs> I, I'm not going to be able to remember the speech. Um, I don't have any money. Man, <laughs> Okay, that was so funny. Oh, my God. Uh, Seth MacFarlane is so incredibly talented. I, I just love him. And it's so funny when, like, I watch, like, interviews and things like that with him, and he's just speaking in his normal voice, and he totally sounds like Brian, and it's just hilarious. And how in the heck is it that I did not know he did Quagmire when I've been watching Family Guy for a million years? How did I not know that, or did I? I don't think I did. That's wild. Anyway, so interesting. Um, I thought this was super cute, and again, I'm a huge fan, so I, I had to watch this one. Um, so yeah, so thanks for for sharing. Never heard of this talk show though, the Graham Norton show, never heard of him. Um, but that doesn't mean anything. There's lots of talk shows that I've never heard of. So I have no idea what this was about. It's like totally different people. I don't know if they all did a movie together or something. I have no idea what was going on. But anyway, I just watched it just so I could hear Seth MacFarlane do all of his family guy characters. Loved it. All right, you guys, um, let me know what you thought about today's video. Are you a family guy and American dad fan? If so, tell me why. And also, who's your favorite family guy character? Mine is obviously Stewie. He's so crazy. Like, something's wrong with Stewie. <laughs> and I love him for that. <laughs> Anyway, share your thoughts in the comment section below guys and if you enjoyed my reaction Please be sure to leave this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell That way you're notified every time I upload a new video And if you have something you'd like to see me react to send it to my email just at gmail.com Guys don't forget to follow me on all of my other platforms all of that information is in the description box below I love you so much. Thank you for watching until next time. I will see you in the next video Mwah. Bye. I cost my life for profit. Never that price too high to be honest. Gold mine, all of my blood. My whole mind harmonized with the cosmic. I get sounds from the Godzilla often. I cause the vibes so hard, keep caution. Never that faith in the